What's up everybody? It's Titanic Feet Jack and I'm back at you again. Today we got an early review on one of the sneakers that are highly anticipated because it kind of been slow as far as hype releases are really good sneakers. But before we get into that today, we need a couple things from you guys. You already know what to do. Hit the like button, leave a comment down below, hit that notification bell, and sub up to the channel if you haven't already. Now today I'm not gonna hold you too long. You see the box, you already know. It's three pairs of these. Y'all see that Black Mamba logo. Box tag right there. Yes, I was blessed to get an early pair for retail. You see you got that scaly snake skin all over the box. This is the bottom of the box. Gonna read it to you, it says Nike 4 Pro Tro. And the color is Varsity Royal White. This is a US size 15 personal pair. And the retail price was $190. It came to like $208 after uh, taxes. Uh, here you go. Blacked out. White paper. Uh, let's see anything else in here. No YCM stickers in the box. That's pretty much it for the box. Let's get into the shoe. Here we go, guys. We have the Nike Kobe Pro Tro 4, the Philly pair. Uh, this is a retro of a sneaker that released in 2009. Uh, I did not get those in 2009, but I was able to touch my pair this year in 2024. These are set to release on April the 13th on the anniversary of the last game that Kobe played in the NBA. Now this sneaker uh is majority royal blue. You got a semi-translucent hit right here on the quarter panel with the royal blue underneath there and you have your fly wire technology going on there. You have a white swoosh trimmed in a crimson colorway. Uh, you do have, I'm not sure if the uh, camera picking it up, but you do have some 3M going on here with the stars going around the ankle padding. You do have some leather right here going on your uh, mud guards. You got uh, Kobe signature right here on the rear lateral heel. You do have a white fire line midsole and you got your, uh, your zoom air technology right there. You got your semi-translucent hit right here on the uh, midsole. Uh, this is a look at the outsole of the sneaker. You have that raw, your blue, you have white, you have that uh, that crimson red colorway, and uh, the uh, raw, your blue is semi-translucent. You can see that right there. And we're gonna look at the heel of the sneaker you can see Kobe's number 24 the second number he wore in his career is ingrained back here you got the uh, semi translucent heel on top of here and we're gonna go to the medial side of the sneaker you do have that white swoosh trimmed in that uh, crimson red colorway semi-translucent quarter panel with your fly wire technology and you have more of that uh varsity royal underneath there you can see more of those stars there uh, you got your midsole going on the white uh, zoom technology and you got your carbon shank plate right there as well and you got some white and semi uh Translucent Varsity Royal you ain't got a hit of red right there. Does come stuffed with tissue and give you a look at that toe box. Here's pictures of the toe box. The tongue. You, go. you got your uh, mesh netting system all the way up to here. Then you got your uh, Mamba logo right here in white. And you do have one pair of laces that come with these laces. These the only laces it came with. You have a crimson color sock liner. And on the inside of the sneaker, there is uh, an insert that is Varsity Royal. 
and it got crimson color stars on it and it has 0823.78 and a Nike swoosh in white. That happens to be Kobe's birthday, he born August the 23rd, 1978. That was a great year. <laughs> And let's look at the uh, the tag on the inside. If I can get a good look at okay, it. Okay, guys, this is your size and tag. The production date, September 21st to December 21st. And this is a size 15. So uh, you had about three months of production with these sizing on these. Everybody know the Cobras run small. So size up a half a size if you are able to or if you're like me unable to i went an entire size excuse me an entire size up so these are the philly pair these are rumored to be the most limited of the three pair i'm going after all three but my favorite of the three is the venice beach and that seems to be, at the time of recording, that's gonna be the most uh, produced pair. They are currently on the uh, Hibbit slash City Gear raffle app, so make sure you enter that. Uh, All the Right has a raffle going on for the uh, Venice Beach and the uh, Italian Camel pair. Also, uh, Social Status and APB, those guys, have the raffle going on as well so you're gonna have to put boots to ground to get these guys because uh the tier zero stores and maybe a couple other people are gonna likely be the only ones to get these aside of uh the sneakers app if sneakers app is your only option i'm not sure how that's gonna play out for you but i wish everyone luck in getting these uh let me know your thoughts on this sneaker and we're gonna roll out like i always tell you guys if you can help somebody get a sneaker help them get that sneaker because you never know when it will be your turn to need help getting the sneaker i'm titanium feet jack signing out